Hey guys, Mortimer here. Welcome back to Man of Medan. Fudge, dude. I I legitly had to uninstall and reinstall this dude because I rage quit on my failed QTE. And I was just praying, just hoping, don't say my failed QTE, dude, because I didn't think I had my hand like right here. And then the QTE just pops out and I'm like, oh no, it wasn't right here, but it was just somewhere like just far away from the keyboard. And, you know, I was going to start it. The turret, we can get in through there. Do we want to get in through there, though? Ooh, don't cut off your suit right there. Fuck! I'm gonna throw my head. <laughs> if if it makes me continue off of that Miss QTE, I'm actually gonna be upset. Oh my fucking god! I'm I started off. I was like, no, 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 no. You know, it's not gonna be perfect gameplay. You know. Said, oh my god, it's gonna be a perfect oh gameplay. Really? Really? No way! I swear, I did not reach. I <laughs> Let's go! The turret. We can get in through there. I have been blessed. No fucking no way. I've actually been blessed. No way. No fucking way. Be dangerous. Oh my god. I keep my hand uh, on the keyboard. First? Fuck that. Can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? Oh. Huh? It doesn't really tell me anything, but... Alright. Fuck, there you go. Oh god, he scared me. Julia, leave it. I'm leaving now it. take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? I ain't going. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. Hell nah. Freaking that 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 Conrad. Whatever. Fuck that. You got me fucked up. You think I'm going there? It's a freaking bullet. Secret oh. found. Nice. All down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Good God. <sighs> Good God, let me inspect this. Something. Oh God. We've been cursed. Wow. What the hell happened here? Look at things. I just instinctively things pressed A, bad. dude. I, I was ready for that QTE just to pop up for no damn reason. Uh, you hear that? Let's check it out. You check it out. Bearing updated? Ah, shit. Fuck. Just give me the jump scare already, Jesus Christ. Ah! I think I wet my wetsuit. That's not even fair! It literally would scare anybody! 
Fuck. And co-pilot. Wait, Got so me. boomstick is good for one time? Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. It's so stupid. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, fuck that. <sighs> So big like that. Uh, I'm telling you something I have to do. Fuck. Fuck. I have to do it. Fuck. I have to do it. Fuck out of here. This is stupid. I underwater shit is stupid. He's holding something. Oh my god, I already looked at this. Fuck me, dude. Huh? I see that. I can't press on it though. Yeah, I saw that, right? I see it. What am I doing? So look, look, I'm gonna go in here, right? I'm gonna go in here, you're gonna see something. Dude, I saw something selectable in here. What are we supposed to do? I don't understand. I don't get it. He's holding something. Yeah. What am I missing? I could have sworn I saw something that you could select in there. I swear I saw something. Fair enough. Should we fucking leave? Oh, okay. Huh? We gotta get out of here now. It's a gray reef shark. Not interested in us. Let's go. I was ready for the calm down thing. That's why I was uh, looking for the S button. Oh, okay. Thought this was the right time, but then didn't know if it was the right time. But I guess no time's the right time. I, I, I don't I guess. Oh. I know you can't tell because we're underwater, but I'm on my knees right now. Uh huh. Julia. Will you marry me? I... I... Oh, crap. I, Alex, I'm, I'm sorry. I, I mean, I, I... I just... I mean, we almost just died. Julia, I'm serious. <sighs> Alex, I... I, I just... Bad timing, I, I know. Well, it's terrible timing. I, I'm sorry. It, this is so no, stupid. No, no, stop. I'm sorry. Please, don't, don't apologize. I, I, I just need time to think about this. Like, ah, oh, fuck. You know, like when I'm not about to die at the bottom of the ocean. Man, I would have said off, like if I did say Julia. yes, whatever. We're back up, over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? Wait, Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa, oh, shit. damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. Damn it. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. So, how do we decompress? Oh my god, this is 
taking too long. This is torture. What? See the way to decompress before surfacing. Just a few more seconds. Is that bad? Go, go, is that good? Go, go. Did, did this hey, I, I, I don't know what's on? I don't know what's right. I don't know what's wrong. It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. Everything just blew up. What happened? Oh, you were. Jesus Christ. There was a little uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. So why are you paying the ocean? A group of fishermen came by and damaged their boat. Well, they got caught on the dive line. Oh, that's what happened. Yeah. So then uh, Ambassador Conrad figured the best move is to show him he'd rather throw away his money than give it to them. You're an asshole. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Unfortunately, we did not leave it as pristine as we could have. What? Why? The dive line, actually. How bad? Uh, ripped open your shit. There's no cockpit anymore, for starters. God. Well, that's just fucking perfect. What can I tell you? What can I tell you? It wasn't my fault. That's all I gotta say. Oh, I love this. What's the deal, man? Tell me. What's the damage? You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers, then. Alex and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. <sighs> if only she felt the same. What about Conrad? A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, stubborn. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Let's go! I said special feature unlock. What did I unlock? I said I'm doing well. I'm doing well. What is this special feature? Where is this secrets? Whoa. I'm a bullet, but I don't think that means anything. No, 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 I'm not done. What a special speedboat. Uh, wait, so. Damn, because he told him to follow his gut. He proposed to Julia, and then Julia said no. Damn. Julia waited to compress before surfacing, so that's the start of something speedboat. Alex took the bang stick on the dive, so that's, that's using his brain. That's using big brain. And then Julia used a bang stick to open the door to the cockpit. And then Alex's knife was not used. That's going to that's gonna be a factor. That's going to be a factor. He says we're doing well. I don't know how, but... How well preserved was the plane? Brad, we're doing well. Insane. It was like traveling through time. No shit. Well, it was like traveling through time and accidentally ending up in a dimension where the past is underwater and everything is covered in barnacles and sharks. Sharks? Yeah, well, just one shark. Ah. Uh. Hey, when was enough? Wasn't Conrad gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. <laughs> oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. Can I ask you why you said no? Alex, I'm sorry. I, I wasn't thinking straight. You weren't? Julia, what does that mean? I mean, I was about to die. 
Well, we almost just got ourselves killed, and then suddenly out of nowhere, you pop the question. Okay, I got you. But, uh. Hey, you see, I understand. I guess I still don't really God understand. God damn it. If it wasn't such a. uh. intense situation, would your answer have been any different? Yes, my god. I think so. Yeah, I. I, th I think I just. I got surprised, and I'm so sorry I ruined it. No, you didn't. I'm the one who's sorry. There we go. I thought that was it. The end of a relationship. Wow, that would suck. I love you, Alex. You know that, right? Of course. I love you, too. Uh, where's everybody else? I'll go. Oh, when they talked, when they... Talked about it later. They patched things up. Oh, oh, yo, this is a bear. Is this a bearing about to be filled up? Wait, okay, so all his guts. There's not that many left. There's about one, one two, three. F I want to say four. So one, two, three. Would I be able to? That won't. I think four. No, that's way too many to be four. There's. Sorry. I'm thinking it's too here? much. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. What did you get distracted so, by? Which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? On behalf of my family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, uh, it's okay. I can deal with children. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. Like a horny fifth grader, Jesus. Ah, uh, Conrad, don't hate me. What's the deal, Conrad? Okay, we, our relationship literally never changes. Like, it's like everlasting. I mean, we are relatives, but still, like, what the hell? <sighs> All right, we're doing everything right so far. We're doing well. All right. I'm never leaving Let's my take a look at the fingers we found. off a of WASD. Why the plane was out here. My middle finger it? is. In your case. Okay, I'll go get it. My hey. middle finger. Let's see. You all right? You seem kind of preoccupied. I forgot what I was getting. I was talking. What? So I had to do the entire time? So if the accident means we can't do mm. any more diving? Let me just say this once more for the record. Going into that plane was super dangerous, obviously, and twice as illegal. Okay, now damage is done, so we just have to lie about it forever, or else we're gonna go to jail. Well, my lips are safe. So, we're going again tomorrow? Imagine he cut the pic if she cut the picture of the piranha fish, that would actually be kind of cool. Yeah, it seemed a little too dangerous. I kind of want to look around. Let's sweat it. I'll go down with you and we'll be fine. Hey, got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted. No worries. Let's go get it. Got it. Let's go up. Get the fuck out of here. Come here, you vixen. <laughs> Easy, tiger. We should get back. Wait, right my, my finger left the keyboard. That was unfair. That was I bet you a QT was about to pop up. I hate that you always gotta be on your guard. This is ridiculous. See, I don't hate it. <laughs> You'll get no resistance there. All right, everyone, check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. Did you find anything else? We did find a bullet stuck in the fuselage, but that was about it. Wreck this, all of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. You're right. 
We should have been more careful. That's not me, I'm sorry. Okay, maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? Y yeah, I heard a story. Uh, happened right around here, too. Oh, it's boy, here. it's a true story. I'll use a good show. I don't know if Brad is really the scary type, you know? Well, don't get too confident. This is a pretty scary story. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. Oh, boy. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, true story? Where'd you hear this? Ah, well, down by the dockside, I found an ancient old man, skin like a leather book, eye patch, wooden leg, the whole nine yards. And for a dollar, he told me his secrets. Seems legit. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Shh. The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an ax. Always an ax? I mean, do people even use axes anymore? I'm just reporting the facts, cliches and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets with an ax. Giblets. So gross. Okay, so who did it? So, the woman, uh, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here. In the closet. Yeah, marriage is a bitch, huh? So the lighthouse keeper creeps over to the closet, opens the door, and, sure enough, there's a man inside. But he's cut his own throat. Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. Sees himself. And he sees. It's his own face. And then its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> yeah, it's so ah, gross. Hey, oh, super twist. Nice. Dude, <laughs> it's nice his face change is not fair. You have me going. It's pretty cool. Heavy on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay. Oh my god, I would have died. We should all turn in there. Who did I change with? Alex. She said no, the proposal. Yeah, of course. Why does my skip button never work? Brad. Come on. So my biggest relationship with Alex makes sense because I had a truthful selfish. Really? Selfish? Really? Some weather hitting, are we? Uh uh. No, no, no. No, because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. Mm. What regular issues are these? Uh, it's standard issue, regulatory, institutional protocol, subdivision 1099. Uh huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance? I'm just following orders, ma'am. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> 10 4, good buddy. And I'm out. <laughs> and I'm out. Fuck this game. Why would they change his face? Like he's possessed or something. Oh my god, was that trying to tell us something? But then wouldn't they have seen it? Duke of Milan. 
That definitely has to be a freaking Man of Medan kind of thing. Duke of Milan. Come on, you're not What the fuck? I don't think I just locked your doors and you decided to sleep. Oh shit, we're dead. We're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead, we're dead. We had good lives. We had such good lives. What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? He's dead. <laughs> Quick time event, bitch! Oh yeah! Quick time event! Oh come on, I hit the quick time event and we're in a situation. That's pretty whack. Oh boy, 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 oh boy. I hit the quick time event, that's not fair. Dude, just imagine if I didn't hit that. I don't know how I hit that. I wasn't even expecting a W, if I'm being honest. Just so instinctive. I like how that guy just shook it off, was perfectly okay getting hit in the bottle in the face. <sighs> do it. Great job, Con. Con is it Conrad? Yeah, good job, Conrad. Wait, where is, um... Wait, you're not his knife. Just like double drained it or some shit. Hey, so uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh god damn it, Conrad. Great, just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey. Alex, what are they gonna do to us? Us? No. I wanna get out of here. I'm in a lot of danger. Guys, we gotta get untied. Right now. Come here. <laughs> Shit. No, it's no good. Come on. Be back for you later. Conrad! Quick time, Ben. Nobody bet. knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You oh, can go fuck, fuck yourself, you piece of shit. I'm gonna you're slap the shit Oh boy. <laughs> wow. Oh god, don't throw me overboard. Don't throw me overboard. Dude, if you're gonna follow a board, you better follow a board not knocked out. What do you fuckers want? Shit. Stop! Please, just stop. Stu? 
slow down. Easy. Please. Just stop, man. We finish with him later. Oh my god. We just got up with Witty. Let's go. Oh my god, my escape button work. Let's go. Be on your best behavior, little man. Okay. Okay. Oh shit. Pretend to be untied. I mean, pretend to be tied, not untied. Oh, Jesus, Conrad. Stick. Shut the fuck up. I don't think they're gonna hit her. They haven't hit Fliss. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with him. Did you see my brother? No, fuck. No. But I'm, I'm sure he's fine. These guys probably just want money or something. All right. Around. Damn. Guarded, reckless, foolhardy, impatient. Okay. Don't let them see your hands. Once we get Julia back, maybe we could take them by surprise. Let's do it. Okay. They're coming. Let's fucking go. <sighs> Wait, you saw it. I see him. Hey, hey, are you okay? What did they do to you? I'm fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. to wait and see what they want to do with us. Got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. Get some help. If you can distract them, I can get on that boat. The dude with the gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys, distract them. Conrad, just stay focused and get to the boat. Okay, let's do it. Sorry. Conrad, just get to the boat. Fuck. I did that way too early. Don't fuck yourself. Tommy, now! Ah! 
Who the hell is Connie? I feel like I get shot. Let's get the fuck out of here. Oh, fuck. You know what? I've had enough. I want you off my boat right now. Get off my damn boat! Conrad to fuck yes. We can't catch him with this old junker. Bring them downstairs. Take this. Use it if you have to. Sit down. Over there. You, right here. Sit. Now. Fuck. Arrêtez, bande de con! C'est mon bateau! Stop! Ferme-la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule! Dude, where is his little brother at? Olsen! Come here! Which one of you is gonna tell me about this Manchurian goo? Where is a little brother at? Piss not for now, but dude, I want to get off this boat first to get past. He can take care of himself. All right, shut the fuck up. That dude might pass out soon. There is no harm in just talking. You want to talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna say it. Fliss has got to be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's the captain and. They barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. How dare you. Are you out of your mind? How did you come up with this bullshit? How fucking dare you, you overprivileged asshole. You're all in this together. This is a trap, and you set us yeah, up. Yeah, so. I feel like he's playing. Like I feel like he's trying to help Fliss right now. He's doing. He's. He's not. I feel like he's not. I feel like he's being smart right now. I could be being overthinking it, but I feel like he's being smart right now. Put a cork in it. Ooh. Ooh. Sit still, all of y'all. How long the storm is gonna last? Will you try anything, anything fishy, and there be consequences. Get it? Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. We read you. Everything okay? Over. 
Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A-okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. job looking after number one. Real smooth. Great leadership, Fliss. Oh, he's being serious. You know about Brad? Is he hiding somewhere? Jesus Christ, dude. than with these psychos. He's being oh, yeah, serious. Right. He could get killed down there. Brad's a big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. Oh, no. Can we not? QT and I have coming. There's a QT yet. Give me it. Give it to me. Or oh, we're just dying. Everyone's still alive. Things could have been quite different. Really? Really? Uh, can we come dive right there? <laughs> That's pretty sick, I'm not gonna lie. You appear to have saved somebody. A bold move that paid off. This time. Oh. Does this make the rest of your group more vulnerable? I dare say we'll find out. Hmm? <laughs> Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? What is it? <laughs> okay then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Act 2, Shut 
just in case you forget merchant of Venice act to think scene seven the prince of morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads all that glisters is not gold all that glisters is not gold all that glisters is not gold what does that mean the attractive eternal appearance of something is not a reliable indication of its true nature oh often have you heard that told anyway now that you've reached a point of significant distress i presume you're eager to get back to your story but here's a thing everything may not be entirely as it seems Probably shouldn't have said that. I think this is a game. Holy shit! All right, thank you guys so much for watching this Men of the Dead gameplay. If you guys enjoy it so far, we have everybody alive. I don't know how in the world we do, but um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next, <laughs> woo, next video. Bye bye. <laughs> Oh my god. That sudden noise is not cool. Aw, you gotta be kidding me. I guess this we don't have a controller to hold. Or is it like that have a controller too where you gotta press it too? Am I tapping it or am I holding it?